For us to see the world around us, light enters the front of the eye and passes through the vitreous before it's focused on the retina. The vitreous is a clear gel-like fluid inside the eye. The retina is the light-sensitive tissue lining the back of the eye. Often, tiny clumps of cells form inside the gel-like vitreous. These clumps cast shadows on the retina. These are what we call floaters. They can appear as dots, circles, lines, clouds, or cobwebs in our field of vision. Floaters are more common as we reach middle age. This is the time in our life when the vitreous gel may start to thicken and shrink, forming clumps or strands. If the vitreous gel is rubbing or pulling at the retina, you may see flashes of light, or what we simply call flashes. Most floaters and flashes are harmless. However, when the vitreous shrinks, it can sometimes tear the retina as it pulls away from the wall of the eye. If these tiny tears bleed, new floaters may appear. A torn retina can lead to a more serious problem called a detached retina. This is where the retina lifts up from the back of the eye. A detached retina can cause permanent vision loss if it is not treated right away. Floaters and flashes may be warning signs of a retinal detachment when you have a sudden appearance of new floaters or many floaters, shadows in the side of your vision, seeing something like a gray curtain moving across your field of vision, seeing flashes, especially with new or many floaters. If you have these symptoms, call your ophthalmologist right away. Treating a torn or detached retina immediately can save your vision. Also, if you have any questions or concerns about your eyes or vision in general, don't hesitate to bring them up. Your ophthalmologist is committed to protecting your sight.